Catholic high school now reversing its decision to not hire a gay counselor who planned to marry her partner. This has got a lot of tension across the country. St. Mary's Academy in downtown Portland voted to change its hiring policies today. This comes two days after the public found out the all-girls school pulled its job offer from Lauren Brown to be a counselor. Alisa Balick is live with reaction tonight. Yeah, Dan, many are pleased with the decision. There was a huge storm of protests on social media and in person by students, parents, and the community at large when this came to light. Now, today, the school held meetings with its students and parents to explain the reversal, but at what cost? This was a really courageous decision. St. Mary's students tell me they're thrilled by the news. Their school board quickly changed its mind and voted to change its policy on equal employment. In a statement today, the school board said, quote, effective immediately, St. Mary's has added sexual orientation to its equal employment opportunity policy. They went on to say, quote, St. Mary's is a diverse community that welcomes and includes gay and lesbian students, faculty, alumni, parents, and friends, including those that are married. In fact, students told me today there's an LBGT club at school with dozens of members. And are people comfortable being out? At school? Oh, definitely. St. Mary's is a very, like, accepting community, so... Um, yeah, there are a lot of people who are out and very comfortable with it. So why did the school withdraw its offer to Lauren Brown to be a college counselor here after she told them she was going to marry her partner? It was the issue of same-sex marriage the Catholic Church had trouble with relative to church doctrine. And some here believe the school didn't want to lose its ties to the Catholic Church. We don't necessarily have autonomy in these kinds of situations. We have to answer to uh, a lot of ranks in the Catholic Church. Um, and right now we might be at risk of losing our Catholicity, and that is something that nobody wants. I asked the local archdiocese whether there will be consequences for the school's decision to not discriminate based on sexual orientation. Their response, quote, The archdiocese is aware of the decision made by St. Mary's Academy and will continue our conversation with school officials. Now, meanwhile, the school gave the job to someone else, but says it will try to reconcile with Ms. Brown. Through her attorney, though, she said she is very grateful for the support from the students and parents, but she wishes the school had changed its policy a month ago, and no word yet on whether there will be a lawsuit. Dan? And